We've seen some great fans tonight, so next week we'll mark the return of our Lee Kinsel Sales and Service Fans Week contest. But never a break for Zach Keith in orchestrating the Layfeld Welding Top 5 Plays of the Week. A lot of regional final action here in this week's top five. Kicking off with Otto Glandorf taking on Bishop Hartley. Tyler Ebiscotti getting the, in the backfield. Blocks the punt. Huge game coming down to the wire. Up next, Marion Local on a packed facility. It's Dwayne Ligers looking for Ryan Toby over the middle. Look at this leaping catch and double coverage as the Flyers dispatch Mechanicsburg in back-to-back -back years. Bad weather wouldn't stop Ayersville from airing it out this week as Dawson Dales throws it up to RJ Addington. The ball pops out, but Ethan Schlachter there for the catch. Talk about right place, right time. There's your slow motion. Lynched it replay and a nice spin for the extra yardage. Big matchup at number two as Coldwater takes on the number one team, Cincinnati Hills, here in the fourth quarter. Neil Mullenkamp gets the handoff and he just will not go down. He gets from being bottled up to green grass all the way to the house as Coldwater makes their way back to the state semifinals. We'll have highlights of tomorrow's state semifinal game down outside of Columbus. Double OT at the top spot this week. Crestview with one last chance to get in the end zone against McComb in that second extra session. But Cam Morris of the Panthers gonna pick it off in the back, right near the goal line there. What a play for Chris Algie's bunch headed back to state. We'll have the broadcast of McComb and Minster tomorrow night. That's your Layfeld Welding Top 5 Plays.